remarkable young man. So we dropped the formality of being diplomatic decades ago, <laughs> Mason. Well, he certainly made for an eventful engagement party. Taylor's taste in men has always been a few steps beyond my comprehension. Allow me to enlighten. She loves Eli because she sees you and him. Well, your spirit, your intellect, your Genzu sharp legal mind. Hmm. If I didn't know you any better, I'd say you were buttering me up for something. Well, as it turns out, there is a legal matter we've been handling in-house. But since the EEOC has allowed the claim to go forward, it's time for me to retain outside counsel. The EEOC? What's the claim? Discriminatory hiring practices. The plaintiff is a young lawyer that we interviewed but ultimately didn't hire. I ultimately didn't hire. So she goes and files a discrimination claim? He did, actually. Is he gay? Not as far as I know. Sorry, I don't understand. What's he alleging? Racism. He claims I didn't hire him because he's black. Where's your representation, Mr. Bennett? I'm pro se. I didn't spend three years at law school to pay some guy to do what I can do myself for free. And what's that? Lose spectacularly? Matt Dowd, right? Didn't you just get spanked for five mil by a lawyer in your own firm? Let's talk about a trial date. Actually, we don't think you want to take this matter to trial. That's not in your best interest. I've never met an opposing counsel who's concerned with my interests. I'm just trying to save you time and rule 11 sanctions for filing a frivolous claim. The EEOC gave me go-ahead for this trial, so it might be a little less than frivolous. Be that as it may, a suit like this would make you virtually unemployable in this town. Not if I win it. What you won't. What are you going to do, argue Mason Andrews is prejudiced against African Americans? That he's prejudiced against himself. Not himself. Or anyone in his current zip code. Uh, it's black folks like me he can't stand. Get back to me about the trial date. Seems pleasant enough. Can't imagine why I'd have a hard time finding a job. What do you mean you don't understand? Black people like me make black people like Mason Andrews uncomfortable. What did Mr. Andrews say his problem was with black attorneys? He'd never state his prejudice outright. Did he ever tell you why you didn't get the job? No. So you have no evidence from Mason Andrews' mouth or any of his friends or colleagues that he didn't hire you because of your race? Asked and answered, counsel. Why didn't you apply for a job with my firm, Mr. Bennett? We recruit from the same applicant pool as Andrews Worth. Just didn't think he'd be a good fit. So you made a choice about what firm fits you best, and yet you're suing Mason Andrews' firm for making the same kind of decision. It's not the same kind of decision. I beg to differ. Perhaps I should sue you for discrimination. I did not go through 12 years of Catholic school in three years. Suing God now, are we, Eli? <laughs> uh, not the Almighty, sir, uh, just his church. Actually, not an entire church, just a priest. Um, people do that all the time these days. It's like buying a hybrid. <laughs> That's not why I summoned you. Please sit down. Taylor told me about you breaking off the engagement. I'm not angry with you, if you're concerned. I'm not concerned. I <clears throat> panicked would be more accurate. I hope I didn't influence your decision in any way. Is that what she... She wasn't forthcoming with specifics. She's amazing, sir. And I'm sorry it didn't work out. The reason is personal. If there's nothing else? No. You can go. <laughs> <laughs>